Okay, I hope that solves the orientation issue. Hi everybody, I'm in the Staten Island Ferry Terminal in Lower Manhattan. I'm going to take the boat, the ferry, to Staten Island and start exploring. The date is January 27th, 2020, 1.21 p.m. It's about 4 degrees Celsius right now. That's about 44 degrees Fahrenheit. I just uh, put my windscreen from my external microphone onto the bottom of the iPhone. So hopefully the wind noise doesn't become too much of a problem. And I hope I don't lose my windscreen either. That may be an issue. So I'm not going to need the charging port yet. So hopefully this windscreen will stay on for a little while until I get the low battery warning. This is the Staten Island Ferry Terminal. Right now the people are lined up at door number three for the ferry to come. Yeah, the ferry wide ride is windy, but I have a windscreen on, so I hope the wind isn't too much of an issue for the audio. Yeah. Tunisia is asking why am I in Staten Island? This is not Staten Island yet. I'm still in Manhattan at the Whitehall Terminal. The ferry is going to leave at 1.30 p.m. Vanessa, thank you for my audio quality. It's been pretty good so far. Jada is 10 saying, do they stop letting cars on the ferry? I think they stopped that back in the 90s. Timothy, I'm not using the sock on my mic right now. I'm using my windscreen from my other external microphone, but it's not a great solution because I don't have access to the home button nor the charging port. So I'm just going to use it for a little bit. Yes, Vasile, we know about Kobe Bryant. You don't need to spam it four times. A newsboy asking if I ever came to the Bronx. I have plenty of videos on the Bronx. Just so you note, know, the reception on the ferry may be a little bit spotty. I know T-Mobile, which is my main carrier, has some issues with the audio. I mean, not the audio, the reception when I'm on the boat. So hopefully Verizon holds up while I'm on the ferry ride. I hope I don't drop connection because I'm in the middle of the New York Harbor. Yes, J1, I've been to the Bronx and I've been to Yankee Stadium as well. The ferry is a free ride. Tunisia is asking why I'm going to Staten Island because I want to. That's why. 
a news boy saying Staten Island is one of the most forgotten boroughs, right? It is the forgotten borough. The ferry ride is 25 or to 30 minutes. Gonzalo is asking if I saw a Broadway show. Yes, the Broadway shows are amazing. Jason Bourne, 28, asking if I'm going to the 9-11 Memorial Stand or just riding the ferry. I have some plans, so. It's almost time to board the boat, I think. Almost time to board the boats. Thank you, Jaja. I couldn't have done it without everybody here. It's boarding time, let's go. Jada's 10, you'll find out when I get there. Once again, I hope the Reception, uh, my phone is good enough to live stream on the boat. It may cut out due to not being able to get service, but we will see. I hope it lasts until the Statue of Liberty view at least, or the closest point to the Statue of Liberty. And I also hope this windscreen holds up and doesn't blow away because it's not meant for my phone. John Eaglin saying, do many tourists use the ferry or is it mainly for New Yorkers? It's for both. Most tourists use the Staten Island Ferry as a free way to see the Statue of Liberty up close. And the locals use the Staten Island Ferry to get to and from Staten Island. Yes, all these people are going on to one boat. I'm boarding the Samuel L. Newhouse ferry right now. Keith Burton's asking if Staten Island was ever a part of New Jersey, seeing, seeing how close it is. I think it wasn't because it was settled by the Dutch first. They did uh, have a plan to succeed from New York City back in the 90s, but it was vetoed by the mayor at the time. Let's see, can I go outside? No, I can't. This is all, um, this is all in glass, so you won't be able to see a clear view. But this is what the boat looks like. They got a concession area here. You can get some food and drinks. This is what you can see from Staten Island Ferry. Someone's pretending to be the Statue of Liberty, even though they're not. Last time I checked, Staten Island, um, Statue of Liberty does not move. All right. Very, 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 very
I guess we won't be able to go outside. The only way I know to get a view from the outside is from the bottom area. Uh, Glory, you didn't miss much. Well, it depends which boat it is. Some boats, they have the area where you can go outside and see the Staten Island, um, the Statue of Liberty, and also an area without the glass. Or maybe I just don't know where to go. Oh, here, I can go out and view the lower Manhattan from here. Oh, it pushes, not pulls. Yeah, I knew that it's news now. I could go in the back. My windscreen's gonna come in handy right now. There's the Brooklyn Bridge, Manhattan Bridge over there. Uh, the boat ride lasts half an hour. Yeah, you can stand on the side too. I hope my windscreen doesn't blow away. That's my main issue. Uh, it takes seven. I'm not sure how much the the capacity on the boat is. You can look it up. Lower Manhattan, sweeping around. Keith Burns asking if New Yorkers are happy with Staten Island being part of the city or do you wish uh, you can get some pl place else to replace Staten Island for the fifth borough? I don't really think New Yorkers care too much. I know Staten Islanders, they had an issue with the city kind of neglecting them back in the 90s and earlier. So that's why they had the vote to succeed from New York City back then. But I think Generally, they're happy with being in New York City right now. Great view of Lower Manhattan here. We have the One World Trade Center, Freedom Tower, tallest building in New York City. It has 1776 feet tall. Irene's asking why a ride that long is free because it promotes commerce and people commuting to and from Manhattan. Chico Loco, yes, I am going to get close to the Statue of Liberty. The eagles are just following us. I mean, Staten Island succeeding wasn't the only uh, part of New York City that succeeded. Back in the 1898 consolidation of New York City, Queens County, the eastern half of Queens County succeeded from Queens County and they formed Nassau, Long Island.
so that's New Jersey over there, Jersey City. Lower Manhattan. I'm just looking out the window now. David, the Staten Island Ferry is free. Another warning, I hope that the cell phone service keeps up on this boat because on my T-Mobile service, I don't really get reception in the middle of the New York Harbor. So, uh, Lisa, they do still have the Roosevelt Island tram. Evan Cortez too asking who pays for the maintenance of the Staten Island Ferry. New York City taxpayers because it is owned and operated by the New York City Department of Transportation. Here we go, folks. This is the closest we're going to get to the Statue of Liberty here. Well, Evan Cortez too, nothing's ever really free in life, so there's always going to be something or someone paying for the thing that's free. Scott Longstaff, this is New York Harbor, the intersection of the Hudson River with the Atlantic Ocean. There she is. The official name of the Staten, um, Statue of Liberty is called Liberty Enlightening the World. If you want to go to the Crown, you have to reserve tickets months in advance. I've also been to the Statue of Liberty before. I have a video up as well if you'd like to see it. I go up to the crown there. Very interesting experience. Lisa's never been to the Statue of Liberty as a New Yorker. Me either. Not until a year ago. So I think you should definitely go and visit it. It's not overrated. Don't take it for granted that you live in New York City and you can always visit the Statue of Liberty at any time because if you keep saying that, you'll never visit it, and it's worth experiencing. <laughs> Lamar is asking what months are hot in New York. Um, I'd say starting from May up until late August. That's the hottest time in New York City during the summertime. Mary Elster saying, yeah, she is very green. When New York City received it from the French, it was all bronze and brown in color. That's oxidation for you, all the copper oxidized, and now the Statue of Liberty is green not brown. You can see it when the Statue of Liberty is brown if you look up old postcards and on Google images. Kizzy Moody asking what the cost of this trip is. The Staten Island Ferry is free. Antonio is getting seasick just watching this video. 
I feel bad for you. You don't have to continue watching if you don't want to, if you're gonna get seasick. Let's check out the other side. Everyone goes away to the other side to watch the stat, uh, statue of That off in the distance is Brooklyn. Scorpion says I'm cutting off. Yeah, that's what I figured. Because it's going to be in the middle. And I have trouble with the service too on my other cell phone. So I apologize if it's going to cut out. There's the Staten Island Ferry going back the other way towards Manhattan. And the Verizon Bridge on Staten Island, where I'm going to. Yes, James Stark saying no subway to Staten Island. There were plans to build a subway from South Brooklyn to Staten Island, but those plans fell through. Adam I is saying, is this the only way to Staten Island? No, there's um, how many ways? I'm trying to count. Towers Bridge, Outer Bridge, Bridge, and the other one which I forget. I think Bayonne Bridge to New Jersey. Uh, double L, it's not too cold right now. It's 44 degrees. Cal 6, I'm staying in Staten Island for a little bit before I go back to Manhattan. Nice bridge there. Is the fire train a rush hour train to New Lots? Um, no. Most of the time it goes to Brooklyn College, but the other terminus that sometimes it goes to is, um, I think Eastern Parkway. Crown Heights Utica Avenue on Eastern Parkway. KZ Moody asking from Manhattan to Staten Island is how long? It's about half an hour with the Staten Island Ferry. Fool Hardy Hesso, I'm not tired. I just started this video. How can I be tired? Adam I, Staten Island is part of New York City. You know what, I don't need to uh, use this windscreen anymore because I'm inside. So I'm gonna take it off. K 
Okay, it's off. This is what I was using. I hope it worked well for the lower Manhattan view at the back of the boat. But yeah, that's why you couldn't hear any wind noise. Now let me put it away, so. charger Xavier, I don't think this boat has an outdoor deck. The one at the back is open. For your safety, all passengers are to remain off stairs, ramps, and landings until the ferry has come to a complete stop at the terminal. Remain behind the designated barriers for diving. Failure to do so could result in serious injury. Please check and ensure you have all your personal belongings at no time are you allowed to leave any personal belongings unattended on the ferry. Thank you for writing. JJW saying if I can do a live stream of Macy's to see how much has changed. Um, it hasn't changed too much. You can look at my video on the Macy's uh, during the holidays in December 2019. Winter night, it's 44 degrees Fahrenheit right now. Around four degrees Celsius. Gloria is asking if I eat while I'm walking. Sometimes I do. Yeah, I could show more of the ferry while I'm waiting for it to uh, to dock. It's got some life jackets. All right. Here's the concession area. Let's see how far Manhattan is from here. I'm not going to open the door because it's kind of heavy. Look how far Manhattan. I had to zoom all the way in to see that. Let's go to the lower level. I'm not sure how many seats are on this ferry. By the way, the passenger rules of conduct.
Evans asking why are some seats yellow and some are blue? I don't know. How come the sky is blue and sometimes it's green and sometimes it's white and sometimes it's gray? Some of these questions are too complicated for me to answer. There's restrooms on the ferry too. Yes, the ferry is free. Uh, yes, the Staten Island Ferry wasn't a Spider-Man movie. I'm not sure if it was Homecoming, but I know it was in it. CRX, an African or European one. Louis Cigardini asking if I'm going to be taking the train or the bus. You'll find out. Yes, I did see that 1993 video. It's amazing. I wish today's technology was around back then and I was around to be able to record it all. But I'm living right now in 2020 and I have to do what I can in this uh, year. How many ferries a day? I'm not sure. I know they run them every hour at the minimum. Now I'm getting off the ferry, going to Staten Island now. <laughs> yes, thank you for your concern, man, DC. Uh, if you want to go back to Manhattan, you need to exit into the terminal and go back to wait for the next ferry going back. You can't stay on the same boat. So I'm surprised the uh, reception stayed intact throughout the entire ferry ride. My stream didn't drop at all. So hats off to Verizon for keeping the service going. If, it were, if I was streaming on T-Mobile, I wouldn't have service at all. Uh, Antonio asking if the ferry has Wi-Fi. I never checked. I don't think it does. I'm going to take the Staten Island Railway.
okay, this one's departing. You can see it by the green light there. It does kind of look like an airport. Train on the left departing first. Thank you, BB. The video is very crisp. Uh, Hamazi, hum you can take a bicycle onto the ferry. Oh, apology accepted, Deborah. Check out the map here. Uh, Adam I, this is not the subway. This is classified as a railway. I think it has to do with the, um, something to do with the signals or the track gauge or something, but they do use the same cars as the New York City subway. Marianne's asking is the ferry to the Statue of Liberty free too? No, it is not free. You need to pay to take that ferry. I think it's around $20. Oh, thank you for that, CRH. The track gauge is the same, but somehow it needs to be classifi classified as a railway. Yeah, this train isn't free. It's two dollars and seventy-five cents. Uh, Lisa saying this one for the New York City ferry. Yeah, the New York City ferry is. Um, they charge for that. Christian, I don't say my profession out on live stream. Hexted Z 2019, how much is a single ride, two trip to come and back go? It's $5.50. Trains are very clean. Yeah, George, that's true, but you risk getting caught by the police and getting fined, so.
Evan Cortez. I think this is the only train that services Staten Island. I'm not sure when this railway departs, but we have time to wait. Hi, Broadway. I ever, I always lived in New York. Stormzy, you can eat and drink on the train. Gloria is not, uh, it's not running yet. Alex asking if people still dance, perform, and annoy people on the train there. I mean, it happens from time to time on the subway system, but I don't think it ever happens on the Staten Island uh, Railway. So I think my plan is to take this railway to Grasmere and then walk to the beach. Cal 76, I do. I sometimes do use Uber or Rye services. Christian, I live in Queens. Uh, let's get social info. I have my information in the video description. So my plan is to get off here, Grasmere, and then make my way towards the beach and walk down. As you can see the Staten Island Railway it only runs along the eastern coast. Yeah user admin I wonder if uh, I'll have service there but we will see. I should take a trip to Jersey Shore, Atlantic City, and walk the shoreline. I'm considering it too. Yes, Staten Island. That's what this video is on. CRH, I won't be going to Tottenville. This train is taking a while to start moving. George Smith, I'd have to be the Empire State Building from my favorite building in New York City. It's just so iconic.
Ludo, I think we're moving now. The door behind me just opened. Yankees Patrick, that was your old neighborhood in uh, Sunset Park. I'm glad I could capture it for you. Uh, Mary, I don't go to Staten Island often. But there's a lot of history here and a lot of different neighborhoods. The train's moving now. They're getting ready to move, they just announced. Thank you. Let's go to the beach on the other side of the world. All right. Owen's saying I should do rain walks. I do. I do plenty of rain walks. My latest one was on uh, Chinese New Year. You can check it out on my Black and Shadow channel and also the live stream of Chinese New Year on the 25th. Oh, thanks, Paul. You're visiting New York City at the end of May. Uh, monk, that's a very subjective question. Depends who you ask. Some people are going to say the Staten Island Beach, some Pony Island, some Orchard Beach, Rockaway. If you're going to ask me what my favorite beach is, it's Pebble Beach. train is not empty. There's plenty of people here. Yankee took this train for about five years to work at the World Trade Center. Wow, it's a long time. Kind, I still get weird looks sometimes, but that's okay. A.N., I don't really get your question. I've been streaming already for 49 minutes. the other side over here. Uh, Kai, it's not freezing right now. It's only 44 Fahrenheit. Yes, Manny, it just costs a regular subway fare. And Emmanuel, I'm sorry you had to experience all that. George, what gave me the idea to start making YouTube videos like these because I want to show people New York City for what it is and 
I was surprised when people were watching my longer format videos. I was shocked that people were even watching it. And it just kept going and that's how I started. Well, let me add it. Now you know Staten Island has a train. I'm getting off at Grasmere. Yes, Mandy C. That was a uh, when Staten Island still hosted the Fresh Kills landfill. Are saying any plans to come back to Long Beach? Maybe. Staten Island is known for. Mostly it's a place for people who can't afford uh, housing. The housing is generally cheaper on Staten Island. But there's also the Staten Island Mall. There's the Conference House. There's the Verrazano Narrows Bridge. You got the, um, the historic Richmond Town here. You got the Staten Island uh, Botanic Garden, the Snug Harbor, the Chinese Scholars Garden. Also, you have the uh, Empire Outlets now by the Staten Island Ferry Terminal at St. George. Mary Wells, yes, it's mostly residential. RJU, you Jones saying love far rockway video. Thank you. I enjoyed making it as well. Yes, I did go to uh, I did go to Tottenville before. Also on that day it was like the coldest day of the year, so the ocean completely froze up. It was pretty incredible. Uh, George Smith, I've pretty much seen everything. There's so many like good things that I don't really remember any specific one. And Quan Yushek, this will go up on the channel. Brooklyn Royale moved to Staten Island for Sunset Park in 92. Okay. Sputtering. Yeah, I kind of expect it because now I'm getting into a more residential area. But we'll see. 
Uh, Mar it starts going to Tartan Bill. So are you uh, saying that now is the worst borough in your opinion? Yeah, everyone's going to have their opinions. Getting off. Rasmere. Uh, Gorgira, this is the Staten Island Railway. I just got off the Grasmere exit. Yes, it's going to be very quiet here in Staten Island. That's how it is. The time right now is 2.19 p.m. And I'm going to update the uh, temperature for you all too. So let me look. Right now it's 7 degrees Celsius, 44 degrees Fahrenheit. is Clove Road. This is going to be completely shocking to everybody if you're used to Manhattan and all the city noise and large skyscrapers. It's gonna be completely different than what you what you're used to. Staten Island is really quiet. Yep, it's gonna be a long walk to the beach, but I do walking, and that's what I do. Staten Island isn't really a great borough for walking because sometimes there are no sidewalks. The sidewalks are small or narrow, but it doesn't stop me from visiting. Tanya is asking why am, aren't I at work? I am at work right now. Look for potholes? Yes, I always look for potholes and I try to report them to the city when I can. In my Far Rockaway video, I reported some potholes too. Q 
Steve Burns asking which is more quiet and which is more urban, Queens or Staten Island. I mean, it always depends on what neighborhood you're looking at. There's so many like different vibes depending on which area. I mean, parts of East and Queens are really quiet and they mirror the uh, vibe of, you know, quiet towns in Staten Island as well. Marty's asking, am I concerned about the new terms of service at YouTube? I mean, yes, there's always going to be changes to the uh, environment and to the format. So I don't know if YouTube is going to be around in 10 years, but while it's here, I might as well put it to good use. But in general, Staten Island is more uh, suburban than Queens is. It's a lot less people here. So I'm going to walk east on West Fingerboard Road. CRH saying I should tour Riverdale in the Bronx. Yes, I've already been to Riverdale. I have several videos on Riverdale. I walked all the way to the border of Westchester. Uh, Evan Cortez too. I'm not really familiar with real estate prices, but you can always look it up. You can use a website like Zillow. But in general, prices on Staten Island for real estate are less expensive than the average in New York City. Sardo Theater of the Maccabi. I wouldn't say nobody likes Staten Island. I like Staten Island. It's incorrect to generalize people who live on Staten Island. Gloria says it looks like my neighborhood. That's awesome. It's very quiet here. Jump LC was Staten Island known for, mainly as a place for New Yorkers to live. But as far as tourist attractions, there aren't too many. You have the Verrazano Narrows Bridge, the Staten Island Ferry Empire Outlets, the Snug Harbor Botanic Garden and Cultural Center. Um, the, uh, I think I said the conference house already. And not, there's also the Alice Austell House as well. But those are the main attractions on Staten Island. Yeah, the Staten Island Yankees too. There's a 9-11 memorial here. Um, what else can I think of? The historic Richmond town. Forgot about that. Also, if you're into hiking, Staten Island has a lot of great hiking trails. It's called the Greenest Borough as well. Cafe Loja saying only place in New York City you can see deer. No, I've seen deer in the Bronx at Pelham Bay Park. So that's incorrect. Christian asking how many inhabitants have Staten Island, I guess live in Staten Island. I'm not sure. Francis saying how many miles from Manhattan? That I'm not exactly sure.
All right, thanks for uh, updating the population numbers. Judith Hinton with a $15 super chat. Thank you so much. Happy New Year to you as well. And also, Xin Nian Kuai Le, Gong Hei Fat Choi. I guess you're referring to the Chinese New Year. Wing Fu Feng asking, are there Asians living on Staten Island? Yes. I know some people who live on Staten Island. Keith is asking, is the Bronx the greenest borough or is it Staten Island? It's Staten Island. Staten Island has the most trees of all the five boroughs. It's very, very quiet here. Many Staten Islanders, they have, um, they drive, they don't rely on public transportation. Yeah, there's a lot of nice homes on Staten Island. A lot of nice trees as well. Donnie Russell saying it won't be quiet at 2.30 when the kids get out at school. Oh, Judah saying she used to go to Clove Lake Park and pick blackberries. That's pretty awesome. I didn't know um, there were wild blackberries in Clove Lake Park. And just so I don't get hit by copyright, I'm gonna hang back here for a little bit and let that car that's blasting all the music go through the green light first. Thank you, Oscar Fish. Yeah, no, it's so annoying. I hate capturing background music on my live streams and then I have to mute it. You see, I sacrificed a whole light cycle just because of copyright music. That's how dedicated I am. Yeah, David, you can have a few seconds of music, but you're still not allowed to use it unless you have fair use. Uh, how many hours do I walk every day? I don't really keep track, but not as much as you think.
Uh, right now, I'm in the neighborhood of Concord. I'm walking east on West Fingerboard Road. Then I'm headed straight to the straight to the beach. I like these lamps. They're very unique. The homes are very nice here. Dave ROZ asking if anyone's ever recognized me walking around the city. Happens at least once a week. Yeah, the sun is coming out, it's right there. Frankie's asking if I wear Tim's sometimes. I'm not wearing them today though. Gregorio Solo saying if I've ever been to Tot Hill in Staten Island. I don't think I've been there. I think I tried one time, but I got lost. Oscar Fish with the NZ5 Super Chat saying loving all your walks recently. Have a uh, amazing 2020. And do I have an app that keeps track of my walks like Strava? No, I don't use Strava. The only thing I'll use is the uh, integrated iPhone health app. And if I'm doing the pre-recorded video, then I'll try to have the Google Maps link when I'm finished of where I walked. Take a look at the design of this place. It says Mape Studio. That's a really unique uh, building design. It's not solid. Pong Ski saying, do I ever feel unsafe making my videos? Keep up the amazing work. Sometimes, doesn't happen too often though. By the way, if anyone is interested, there's land for sale across the street with a beautiful view. That's the number, jelanihomes.com. If you're interested in owning a property on Staten Island, Rudd Mulder saying, that, what's the price? I'm not sure, that's for, uh, for you to call up the number and ask. Or go to the website. Bahamakin, I'm not too familiar about the rents and jobs on Staten Island. It also depends on the industry too, the location, the zoning, all things of that nature go into factor with the rent prices. But as Cafe Loja says, Staten Island isn't really known as a place where people work. It's more of a place where people live and commute to work. 
admission homeowner asking if I ever do walks outside New York City. If you've been keeping up like this past month, I have a walk of Taiwan posting every day. And I've also done walks in New Jersey, Mexico City, New Orleans. Uh, Starfire 3 Staten Island is part of New York City. It's Richmond County. The street grid is a little bit strange here, but I think I know where I want to go. Let's go this way. Yeah, no, Mary Elsa, that's one of the uh, contentious issues that people living on Staten Island have. The price of the tolls. I forget how much the toll was for the Verrazano Narrows Bridge, but it's very expensive. The next S53 bus to Bay Ridge 86 Saint Station is 5 minutes away. Alright, so my plan right now is to walk on Major Avenue towards Fort Wasworth, get a view of the Verrazano Narrows Bridge, and then head to, head to the beach. Gonna be tricky here because I don't have a crosswalk. a playground across the street. I'm not sure what school that is. Tanya is asking where the traffic lights are. I noticed they're on the bigger intersections. Yeah, and Merck is saying if you get on the bus, you won't have to pay the bridge, the bridge toll. But you do have to pay for the bus though. That's the only issue. And it's also impossible to walk over the Verrazano Narrows Bridge legally. I wish there was a way to walk or ride a bicycle across the Verrazano Narrows Bridge. Then people can go to and from Brooklyn and Staten Island for free. Mo is Shiri saying, why do the streets not have pedestrians in this neighborhood? Because the population density of Staten Island is very few. It's not very dense at all. No, there's no pedestrian or bike path on the Verrazano Narrows Bridge. 
only motor vehicles can cross. Unless it's a special event like the um, TD Five Borough Bike Ride Tour. Yeah, mission saying you take the ferry and then walk the Brooklyn Bridge. That's a major detour. Starfire is asking what was on the sidewalk back there. Some uh, garbage containers. Yeah, Batgirl saying people mostly drive in Staten Island and don't walk. It's true. Staten Island isn't very a friendly borough for walking. A lot of the streets are um, angled and they don't go straight. Some places there isn't even a sidewalk. Louis GM Design 13, what brought me to Staten Island today because I just wanted to explore and I felt like it. That's why. Tim Southern saying, have I seen road rage on Staten Island? Yes, I have. Uh, Evan Cortez too, I have a day off every day. It's great. Well, I'm surprised there's a lot of um, leaves out here. A lot of these trees shed their leaves late. Will they decompose in time for spring? Magnus saying, do a walk of the abandoned train line in Queens and Forest Park. I have a little bit. I have a video where I walk on it just a little bit. But I wouldn't really want to do a walk through that complete section. You really don't know who's hiding behind the train trestles and abandoned tracks. So that's not really for me. Louis is saying, are there any Chinese New Year celebrations still going on? Yes, they are still going on, but it's not as much as uh, the weekend. Very quiet here. Yes, Pamela is saying it's a long walk to the beach, which is why most people drive in Staten Island. Yes, Patrick saying if I walk up straight, I can hit Fort Wadsworth. That's exactly my plan right now. I think the squirrel has the same idea too. You see the squirrel?
I guess the squirrel's not going to the beach. Instead, it's going to that house to the left. By the way, if anyone wants to move to Florida, it's right here. There's no need to go south. Just go to Florida Avenue on Staten Island. Verrazano Narrows Bridge in front of me. Scorpion wants to know if New York has a beach. There's many beaches in New York City. Francis, I have been to Staten Island many times, but not as often as I want to, just because it's so far from where I am. Uh, yes, Trezor, the residents do get a reduced rate for using the bridge. Very dangerous here. Where am I right now? This is Lily Pond Avenue and Major Avenue. I'm making my way to Fort Wasworth. All right, let's go. Ivan asking if the outlet on Staten Island is worth a visit. I think it is. There's not too many people who go there and visit there though. Making a right straight down is the South Beach. I thought there was an entrance to the fort here. At least from what I saw on Google Maps, Major Avenue goes right into the fort. How cold is it? It's 44 Fahrenheit, 7 Celsius. Oh no, I have to go around to get to the, to the fort. That's not cool. Well, this um, making a right here I see on Google Maps will lead into McLean Avenue anyway. So. 
I'll get to the fort either way. I just thought I was able to go in from here. Anyone want a TV? No guarantees on if it's working or not. JVC. Don't know if it's working, but what's up? It's good for a mirror though. Verrazano Garden Apartments. Looks like a nice little complex. It's an interesting tree. It grew out like bulges and it has branches coming out. All right, so here's McLean Avenue. No sidewalk here, it's only grass. Show the homes if possible. A lot of homes here are similar styles. Have I ever done a video of Highland Avenue? I think you mean Highland Boulevard. When Doggo is saying, am I going to the fort? Yes, I am. Nice view of the Verrazano Narrows Bridge. Uh, the time right now is 2.56 p.m. Uh, it did used to be a army and naval base, I believe.
Mr. Jason R. Black saying, if there's any classic cars I see from the 60s or 70s on my travels, not too often, but occasionally I'll run into them. Scorpion saying it's buffering. No, that stinks. But I guess it's to be expected because there's not too many people who live out here in Fort Wadsworth. Hopefully it'll get better. Evans asking if there's a beach at the foot of the bridge. I don't think there is. Bupentra, my video equipment is listed in the description. Ross saying it's not buffering but a little shaky. I have the gimbal on. I don't know why it's shaking so much though. It's hard to keep it perfectly smooth when I have the um when I'm holding also the power bank like this connected to the phone, so the phone will last longer. Yeah, Evan Cortez too would say like we'll try to duck walk but that'll look too weird. It's also impractical too to do it over long distances. It's good if you're sh shooting like a small scene, but if I'm doing it for like an hour and a half, two hours like I am, then you can't duck walk the entire time or a ninja walk. Francis Martin saying, can we walk across the bridge? No, you cannot walk across the bridge. There's no walkway across this bridge, unfortunately. Jim Greenwald with the super sticker of $3. Thank you so much. I appreciate it, man. Thank you for that. I love it. What's the river there? It's the, um, it's the Atlantic Ocean of New York Harbor.
one time one time I came here when it was snowing and the children were using this hill as a sledding area this place is amazing for sledding so if you like sledding in the winter time and it's snowing you come here you get an amazing backdrop of the Verrazano Narrows Bridge and you can go sled down here there's like a long hill just a thought for you to um, for you to come here Yeah, someone's saying check out the sweet car. I'm not a car person, but someone's going to appreciate that car. And if you want to see the back, the back's over here. Plexi's asking where I'm walking to. I am walking to the underneath of the Verrazano Narrows Bridge. Actually, I think I'll end it here because if I go underneath the bridge, then I need to walk back here and it won't be that great of a view. So I'll just continue on the beach from here. Ashley is asking when I moved to New York. I always lived in New York. Darcy, Gong Si Fa Chai to you as well. Down the path, there's a rocky beach. Oh, I did not know that. But it does say do not enter, so I'm gonna abide by that sign. Or is do not enter mean that it's for the cars only? Then again, it says do not enter over here too. All right, let's go check it out. Patrick walks here all the time. Well, thanks for the information. Now we got to check it out. Look how big that truck is and look how small it is compared to this bridge. Look how many cars are on that truck. Whoa, four on the top of that one. GWK is asking what the temperature is over here. 44 Fahrenheit, 7 Celsius. Pam is asking if I ever encounter celebrities on my walks. From time to time, but most of the time I don't know who they are because they can conceal their identity very well. 
Beverly is asking if I'm scared walking underneath this bridge. No, I'm not scared. Anyone else see that deer over there? A deer right by this water here, waterfront, Staten Island, Verrazano Narrows Bridge. Yeah, I'm definitely not going into any tall grasses. Where am I? This is um, Fort Wasworth. I'm not exactly sure exactly which battery this is. And this is this side over here. Uh, Shina Lace asking if this is the bridge from Saturday Night Fever. It might be. I haven't seen that movie in a long time, so. Patty's saying, how did the deer get on an island? They swim over from New Jersey. It's close enough they can swim across. Nice view from this side. The deer take the Staten Island Ferry. That I didn't know. That would be pretty incredible if they did. South Cliff. So this is from the late 1800s and early 1900s. Battery Bacon. Nice view here too. Yeah, there's no lights here. I also want to make time because sundown starts around 5. So I have about 2 hours, maybe less. Uh, Bodder's asking if you can buy a gun as a tourist in New York City. I don't think you can. Or it'll be very hard to. It's a beautiful view here. Take a look at this, whoa. It's 
some people there hopping the fence going urban exploring probably uh, Evan Cortez too this is my first time in this part of the fort never been here before Yes, when doggo I have been recognized in public. Wow, look how abandoned this place is. And those people just climb the fence. It says the area is closed, but they climb the fence. staying away from the tall grasses that's for sure access is limited to ranger led tours can't go in here too bad looks cool in there though Let's go and uh, hit the beach before it starts getting dark. Friday saying how come there's no one else near me because this is a very uh, off the path part of New York City who would want to come all this way to Staten Island to come to a place like this only me and also those few people who climbed the fence back there Starfire 3 asking what happens if they catch you in the fort. I mean, it's legal to be here. It's just the uh, restricted areas that aren't. Yeah, J GWK a scary place at night. Yeah, I'd be a little bit nervous here too. There's no lights that I can see around here. Well, there's a smell like it smells fresh right here. I wonder if that deer is still here.
Yep, the deer is still there. Let's go by and say, let's go by and say goodbye to the deer. So those of you who've never seen a deer in New York City, now you have. There's also like a little hiking trail here. I'll just go in a little bit, but I won't be going in there. I don't have the shoes for it. Mo is serious saying you want to support me. Can I explain the method? I have a Patreon page. You can um, feel free to give over there. Or you can use the YouTube Super Chat feature. Just by watching the videos, you'll support me as well with the watching of the advertisements. And also have merchandise for sale on my Teespring page. Those are all the ways you can support me. Gwendalia, thank you very much. Now I can show you Fort Wadsworth. Just hit the two hour mark on this stream. Started all the way from Whitehall Terminal in Manhattan, and now I'm here on Staten Island observing deer and also the sky taking pictures of the Porsche. Or I think the proper way to say it is Pache. The R is like silent or something. Uh, yes, I already ate before I came here. Thank you for that. Have I ever done Fort Tilden in Rockaway? Yes, I've been there, but I didn't make a video there yet. Let's go this way and I'll explore some of the beach before it starts getting dark. I say I have at least an hour of good sunlight left. One more shot of the Porsche please. Okay. Robert saying how I read all these comments. I mean, it's very uh, challenging to keep up with everything, but I still manage. I won't be able to get to every comment on this live stream, but I try to get to 
like some of the more important ones and some that are relevant. Take the car home, right. And I did read that Lucy, Lucy, L-I-I-S-U, Lisu Tiramisu. Did I ever make a video of Breezy Point in Rockaway? Yes, I have, but uh, riding a bicycle. Someone said they were riding a bicycle in Fort Wadsworth. Well, here's a cyclist here. Hello. Oh yes, I uh, get the Play More Unlimited plan from Verizon. I may even have to upgrade to the one that's above that one. It's a campground here. Jada's 10 asking how long I've had Verizon since the 11th of January. Not too long. But so far it's been working pretty okay ever since I reset my phone and also upgraded the plan. Really quiet road here. This PCG asking if I do a long walk every day even if I don't film. No, I don't do a long walk every day. The Berlin Wall is ahead. This doesn't look like the Berlin Wall to me. I could probably straighten it out if there's no water in there. Yeah. I just pushed it. Now it's straight for the most part. There we go. Now it's perfect. There's no gaps in it anymore. All right, now it's perfect. What am I doing? I was fixing up the wall.
scorpion and say, will I get in trouble if I get caught? No, I don't think I'll get in trouble. I didn't move the barrier at all. Just adjusted it a little bit. Uh, what river does the bridge cross? It crosses the New York Bay, New York Harbor. Nice homes here overlooking the water. How cold is it over here? It's 44 Fahrenheit. John Eglin with the 50 NOK super sticker. Thank you so much. You're so awesome. You're awesome. Thank you. Ooh, there's a beach here. There is a beach here. We made it to the beach. Nice view, very, very nice view. Look at that, the sun's coming out too over there. Yeah, I wouldn't swim over here though. Pamela is saying you see New Jersey. I doubt you see New Jersey from here because this side is facing Brooklyn. Sun's coming out. Slayer said I can go to the Jersey side now, 15 minute brisk walk. I doubt it. Terry Wheeler with the one pound 99 super chat. Thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Could I do this on an electric scooter? I'm sure you can. What would I do if someone jumps out of the bush? That would be scary. Yeah, B. Mercer saying the beach is much larger. It goes all the way to the South Shore. I can see that. Unprotected beach, no lifeguards. Look at that ship over there. Whoa. And there's a pathway. Have I thought about adding a little live map overlay in the corner? I've done that before. Most people found it distracting. And also the 
phone app that I used to do the overlays, it was unreliable. So I don't do that anymore. Nice view. Yeah, it's too cold for snakes and also too cold for most bugs. It's only in 240p. Oh no, that's not good. I hope that the quality will be better. Oh no, the quality is in 360. That's not good. Come on Verizon, you can do better. And now it's 720. I'm glad that uh, it was able to go up to 720. Layla's asking if I have a 4K quality camera. Yes, I do. But I'm not using it right now. This is the iPhone 8 Plus. Yeah, the lighting is pretty good right now. The sun's just peeking out behind the clouds. I think it's a good idea to ride on the walk on the sidewalk though. Thirteen, Paul. Thirteen. I do sometimes take a taxi home if I'm too tired. Storm Z. I see some squirrels here. I even hear them too. They chirp up in the trees. Well, taxi, Uber, Lyft, I call them all the same things for higher car service. Hopefully I can get out this way. Uh, 
I guess I can't go around that way. I need to go over to the left. It says area closed. I need to go this way. Yeah, that's what I figured. It's uh it's still US government property. There's some sparrows there. There's the Fort Wadsworth Gateway National Recreation Area. Big lawn over here. Atlanta S, the time right now is 3.40 p.m. 3.40 p.m. A lot of litter here, if you notice this. Loose papers and wrappers. What else is here? Uh, David wants me to do mansion at Evan Street and Little Street. I can definitely try that the next time I'm there. Man, look at all this litter here. Not good at all. All right, here's the South Beach. I want to get onto the boardwalk now. Yeah, it's getting dark a little bit, but there's still some sun out. I'm right close by to Father Capadano Boulevard. By the way, if you're ever missing a boardwalk where you can walk underneath, like in the Warriors movie of Coney Island, back in the day, you can still do it at Staten Island. I'm going to do a movie reference now. Go walk underneath here. Ooh, scary. Scary. Oh my gosh, look at this. There's like glass under here. Pink, 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 pink. Warriors. Come out to play, warriors, come out to play. Sorry, I do not have two glass bottles to do that impression.
Yeah, I love that movie. Uh, Mercadusis, this, that's from The Warriors. It's a movie back from the 70s of New York City. Kevin said it's very scary, don't do that again. Well, I saw there was no one under there and I didn't go like all the way in, so it was fine. Cafe Logos with uh, that gang leader like speech. Do you dig it? That was a funny speech too. That's all I remember. Do you dig it? That movie's like a cult classic. The sound's getting uh, windier. Take a look at this view, oh my gosh. This is the eastern side of Staten Island, everybody. The South Beach. It's time to take my uh, sock out because it's getting windy. Not a bad idea, I guess I could. Take out this thing, put this thing on. Ah, oh, almost dropped it. getting hard to put this on. Uh, where's the hole? Okay, that should work, it's on now. So, the wind noise should not be a problem for now, but I can't charge my phone. Which is also not a problem because I don't expect to be walking much longer and the phone's been charging all this time. Alright, let's go. Yeah, there's a lot of wind right now. Can you hear the wind? Yeah, I can definitely feel the wind now.
There's a volleyball court over there and a playground. Robin's asking, is this boardwalk busy in the summertime? I don't think it's that busy in the summertime either. Wow, can you even make out what's on this plaque? It's so faded. It says Happy Land Preservia presents. I don't know. Oh, there was an amusement park here that was called Happy Land. And Kizzy Moody is asking how am I getting home? I'm getting home with the bus to the ferry terminal and then taking the ferry to the New York City subway. There's plenty of buses on Father Capadano Boulevard. I think it goes right to the ferry terminal. Yeah, I could take the bus to Bay Ridge, too. That's another option I can do. Yeah, I'm going to walk up to a certain point and then exit because the sunlight is getting um, is getting muted right now. So I don't want to be out here too long. Yeah, the boardwalk is a long stretch. Goes all the way down the South Beach to Midland Beach. What time is the sunset? It sets at 5.07 p.m. So I have about an hour. But Magic Hour itself only has about half an hour left. Yeah, that is a German Shepherd here. Got the sand dunes here. Yes, this is golden hour for about half an hour longer. Kevin used to work here but never explored it. You should. Here's something I could use. Does it work? No. Does this work? No. Does this work? No. Is this working? Doesn't even look like it's lit. No. I want my Aquafina. Let's try unplugging and plugging it back in. 
Well, maybe I shouldn't. <laughs> All right, I had enough of this boardwalk. Let's check out the neighborhood a little bit. What I do need to do though is blow my nose. I'm starting to get a runny nose. Here's the S51 bus. I can take this bus back. Waiting for the light now. Yeah, they're gonna redo Father Capadano Boulevard. Looks like it's gonna be resurfaced. There's a home under construction. Oh, he's got a heavy load in front of me. That girl lives on Staten Island. No, I'm not sick. I'm just, uh, my throat is dry. I need some water. I forgot to bring my water bottle, so.
Good thing is there's a supermarket up ahead. Polish delicious bread and buns. Whoa. Here's the S-52 bus. It's a Chinese restaurant there. Yeah, I'm gonna go into the supermarket to get something. Let's get a drink. Yeah, it has a muted because they were playing Michael Jackson over the radio. But I got my water here. You know what I really hate? Opening this thing. <clears throat> Need some muscle. Ooh. All right, got it open. Got it open. It's a long trek just with some water. All right. Now I'm hydrated and I shouldn't be coughing anymore. That's good.
I should get Aquafina as my sponsor. Yeah, I should, right? Yeah, they have the plastic shopping bags until March 2020, I think. And then they're banned, but if you want paper bags, they charge you. This is Sand Lane. Uh, plastic bags will be banned in New York City. But for the moment, they're not. Donnie said I should bring the Italian girl to Staten Island. That might be a good idea. Whenever she's back in New York City, I probably could. Uh, which borough do I live in New York City? In Queens. And I don't really know how I'm gonna get back from here, but I'll find out once I hit a major road. And then I'll take a bus back to uh, the Bay Ridge or the ferry terminal. Either or works for me. What does Google Maps say? I didn't check yet. Is this the first time I ever got here? Yes, I have. This is the uh, first time I've been here. Oh, Patrick, thanks for that. I could take the S53 up ahead. I think I'm gonna do that because the sun is setting soon. And I don't wanna be waiting for a bus after dark. David is asking if I see strange people on the subway late. Yes, yeah, sometimes I do. And Irene, the ferry is running uh, all the time. 24 seven. Peter Laycock with the $20 super sticker. You're amazing for that. Cheers to you, thank you. Yeah, it's um, the ferry runs every 30 minutes normally, but when it's a slow time, it runs every hour. Yes, I have a uh, license, but I don't drive.
Yeah, this is a very nice neighborhood. I never walked here before. Donald's asking if Staten Island has a downtown uh, by the St. George area. Well, there's my bus right there, the S53. I'll have to wait for the next one now. Twelve minutes for the next bus. Yeah, I just missed the bus. That's what happens sometimes. Also, I hate it too when you're waiting across the street for the bus and then the bus comes. I want to see what bus this is over here. Oh, the S52 is here. I can take the S52 also, right here. There's also a convenient garbage receptacle for my water bottle. Let me see when the next S52 is coming. S52 just left. It's coming in eight minutes. Yeah, I'm looking at the S52 because uh, it's coming sooner, but I think I'm going to take the 53. The subway is usually faster than the bus. The 53 will get, get me there faster. Uh, I use the transit app. It's just called transit. All right, we're waiting for the bus now. Yeah, foolhardy Kesso, that car was honking to, uh, for his friend. You didn't see it, but they were just honking for their friend, not because of me crossing the street. I'm going to Bay Ridge right now. I'm taking the S53 over the Verrazano Bridge to the R train. And we got a while to wait for the bus.
I'm pretty sure I've taken the 53 before. Yes, I have to take the train to Manhattan and back out to Queens. That's how it works here. And that was my Uber. Now he's just dropping someone off. This store across the street seems like they do a lot of business though. It's open 24 hours. The 52 is coming in three minutes and the 53 is coming to in seven minutes. I just hope it's not too crowded. Yeah, they use Boar's Head. By the way, the 53 just came. Yeah, I'm taking the 53. Yeah, I'm waiting for the bus right now. The S53 to Bay Ridge. It's coming in five minutes. There's another 52 here. 
Yeah, the 52 was empty because there was one that passed by before. I'm using the iPhone 8 Plus on the YouTube app, the native YouTube app. <laughs> the 53 is coming in four minutes, according to transit. Four minutes. This part of Staten Island is called Arrow Char. See you later, GWK. Thanks for joining in. James Tark took the S78 all the way from Conference House to the ferry. That's all a long, long bus route. Wow. Uh, Kevin, I'm taking the 53, S53. How long will it take for me to get home? Probably two hours, I would think. An hour and a half at the least. That wasn't the right bus, that was the S-52. The 53 comes down the, the street, it doesn't make a turn. I was using the transit app.
Here's the 53 is coming. Bus looks a little crowded. Oh wow, it's not working. It's cold. Please exit through the rear door. Uh, my favorite bar was Manhattan. I like how it says it's McLean Avenue. I'm taking the bus to Brooklyn.
bridge. Impossible to walk over this bridge.
Two stops. It's uh, 4.40 p.m. right now. And probably about five minutes more. Yeah, I'm almost wrapping up. Griffin, I just decided to come here because I wanted to.
Finally, I'm here. Is it? All right, everyone, I'm going to sign off here. Thanks for joining in this tour of Staten Island. And I will see you all soon. Take care, everyone. Thanks for joining in. I'm gonna take the train now back to Queens. Needs to go through Manhattan first, but it's gonna be a long way home. Yeah, I know my nose is dripping. I need to blow my nose too. I've got some extra tissues here. See you later.